Hi, I'm Dr. Siler again from Siler Skin and Homewood, and uh, this is uh, the second video in a series here where we're going to do a little bit of Botox. We just did the numbing shot in her because we're going to do some filler after this. So um, this is just a video just to show um, how easy this is to go through. She's done Botox before and has gotten a great result with it. A lot of patients are afraid that um, this really hurts or makes you bruise, and if it's done right, it really shouldn't. Do a couple little shots around the eyes here. So you can see this is pretty easy to, to get through. Not a drop of blood there. I'm going to move to the other side and she needs a little bit more on this side than on that side. Everybody's a little asymmetric and some people move one side of the muscles more than the other. So you'll see me do couple extra shots on this side. You doing okay? Mm -hmm. You feeling much? No. Not too bad? No, it's not too bad. Good. We're going to do between the eyes and the forehead here in just a second. If y'all can hang out for just a minute while we finish this and then you'll get to see the forehead in between the eyes. We can also do Botox in the underarms for sweating. Um, I can do it in the hands, and uh, this also works really great for migraines. For some people that uh, get really bad headaches from migraines, Botox has been proven to make a huge difference. So, all right, we might want to come from a little different angle here, and we're going to turn toward me just a little bit. All right, it's been really hard right there for me. All right, relax. The other thing about Botox is that, in my opinion, most people that do Botox put way too much Botox in people, and I tend to be really conservative with it, so I'm putting about half as much in her as what would be recommended. Uh, so instead of putting 20 to 25 units between her eyes, I'm only putting 10. And this is the dose that we've done for a long time on her, and she's always been really pleased with it. So I, I really know the muscles, and so I'm able to really cater it to the person, depending on how much muscle movement, instead of just doing the same shots in everybody. So, all right, raise up real hard for me. All right, you can see that she moves this upper muscle a little bit, so we'll put a little bit of Botox up here. You can see that this is a really quick treatment, but not too bad at all, just little, little bitty sticks. And put a little bit right there, trying to stay where the camera can see me. And we'll do one more on this side, usually everybody raises one side up a little bit more than the other, and she does this side, so we put just a little extra Botox right here to keep her from raising up too high. So that's it. You can see that we hold just a little, okay, you can look straight for me now. You can see that afterward, you can barely even tell we did it. She'll have just a little red spot in a couple places for maybe an hour or two. She can wear makeup right away, and piece of cake, wasn't it? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I love it myself. I do my own Botox every three months, so I'm a big fan of it. So thanks for watching.